We're still about two weeks away from the Mississippi general election, but some citizens who are too young to make an official vote cast an early ballot for governor. Florence Elementary is this week's cool school. With mock voter registration cards in hand, the littlest of Mississippi's constituents are learning what it means to rock the vote. For the second year, Florence Elementary organized a full election day, and the candidates are real. Third through fifth graders tuck themselves into a polling booth to fill in the bubble beside Jim Hood, Tate Reeves, Bob Hickingbottom, or David R. Singletary. We've had speakers come in and speak to all of our students and talk to them about the importance of voting and why it's important and we have been teaching these students to research each candidate and know who you're voting for and that their voice matters. It's important because in the future we're going to have to do this. If you didn't vote and you really wanted someone to win, maybe the other person would win and every vote counts. And what's a mock voting precinct without volunteer poll workers? I was doing, checking off the people's names on their voter ID card whenever they, so they could vote. I was supposed to make sure that everybody put their ballots in the box and then give out stickers. Even adults get excited about the proof of participation stickers on election day. The mock voting experience is supposed to encourage the kids to get registered when they turn 18. People fought for the right for you to vote and it's your opinion and you don't have to share it with people. That's right, and remember, if you know of students, teacher, a school doing something cool, and nominate them for our Cool Schools highlight segment, just send an email to coolschools at wjtv.com. Andrew.